Ready? I don't know if you are ready for this. Check this out. We have a stove! Yay! Stay tuned. So I'm making plans, suddenly got a little bit cold. Making plans, okay, so this is this is the cabin, right? This is what I'm gonna do, is where that window is, this is going to be removed, and this is gonna turn into a door, right? And it is going to come out to this area here, and this is gonna be the new living area, where that is gonna live in, living kitchen area, okay? Whereas this is going to be a bedroom and I'm going to say a utility area at this stage, which is probably going to turn into a bathroom, right? These are way off on the skew. I know, but come on and check this out. It's a bit messy. We're just finished, guys. Okay, this this right here. Right, let me, let, me, let me get some light on. Bruno, you be careful now. This right here is, is, is a tent stove, right? So what I have done is, um, unfortunately, I, stay. I need, I, need to, I need to tidy everything up. It's very messy. Unfortunately, I did not get this recorded, right? Because, Bruno, come out of it. Because me and John were here. We sort of, we sort of didn't have a lot of time. So uh, let me get another light on. So I, I wanted to I wanted to make sure that I got it done instead of instead of actually. Uh, oh, that is blinding me. You know, in, in, instead of faffing about and making a video, right? That light has a frequency. Check that out. See the frequency? Can you see that? I can see that on my screen. Okay, so that is Bruno. Come out of it. Come out of it. Come out of it. Come out of it. So, what I have done, guys, is when you, when you buy these camp when you buy these camp stoves, they actually come with a they actually they actually come with a They come with the flu in all these sections, right? So what all I, all I literally had to do was buy, uh, I had to buy a right angle, I had to buy two right angles, and I had to buy this bit here, right? Now this bit here is actually, I'm very wary of this, do you know that? But there's no heat transferred onto this at all, at this moment. Very little, very little. So. Uh, what this is is this is a silicone gasket that you could see on 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 the front of the, on the start of the video, guys. And the silicone gasket just goes on the outside. Uh, this is double walled, going through the silicone gasket. There's a lot of heat in these pipes, right? A lot of heat. You know, good boy. So what I'm hoping there's a big big queen wasp coming inside for the heat already. Uh, guys, I'm hoping that I won't really need too much else. And what I'm going to do is I have some old galvanized. Should use away over there. This is and this is what I'm going to do next. I'm going to dig out this old galvanized, right? And for now, I'm going to put the galvanized behind the, uh, the the wood burning stove, right? And what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to put the galvanized on washers. So I'm going to put screws through the galvanized, and then I'm going to put washers. So that hopefully the, 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 the galvanized will store some of the heat but then and reflect it back instead of it just being absorbed into the wood if it even gets that far. But that is my cunning plan right now. But look, a milestone, a milestone for the off-grid cabin guys. We have a feckin' stove. We have a stove, it's really dirty and it's full of tools, but uh, it's it's we, we have a stove and it's very dark, still very dark, but these are these are things that we can work on, aren't they? So I, w I want to burn it for a good couple of hours, guys. This is the thing. I want to be I want to be 
peace of mind. I need peace of mind. Hey, Bruno, can you stop bringing sticks in, please? I need I need peace of mind for this because I do not want to constantly be sitting here thinking that it's going to burn down. Do you understand what I mean? Now, there's a little bit of a gap up there. I'm probably going to have to put some uh, insulate, some um, heat resistant silicone. I think is what I'm going to have to use around the outside of it. But uh, and this is the thing, right? Where that hole is is fine because when I do the rest of the cabin and when I get these upgrades done, guys, that there's going to be a window there anyway. Do you know what I mean? So there's going to be a window that's going to go in right there in in that pane right there. So in that panel, sorry, in that panel right there. So cool, cool, cool. right, let's move on to the next bit, Bruno. What do you think? This galvanize is rotten as well. So I I, I dug out the tin that I'm I'm I'm, I'm planning on putting behind. The, the stove in the cabin, right? And something just came to me. Now this might be nothing, but this is, I'm not gonna install it in the cabin. I'm just gonna end that video after, after I ask you this question. Guys, this is galvanized steel. It's gal or galvanized tin or whatever you wanna call it. As far as I'm aware, galvanized tin, when it heats up, releases toxins. Right, or is, it, is that only if you're burning it or welding it? I'm unsure. Now, what I don't want is I don't want this, you know, because the idea was that this would heat up and retain heat. Uh, but if, if, if this stuff heats up, is it poisonous? I don't know. I'm going to take it all out and I'm going to leave it to one side and I'm going to see what you reckon guys and I'm going to do a little Google as well and talk to friends of mine that are welders and uh, and, and see uh, if it is the case. Now look, it, it looks okay, right, but it's pure rusted on the other side, so so Okay, I'm, I'm going to leave that there. I'm going to leave that there, guys. Let me know what you think in the comments. As I said, I'm, uh, hopefully these videos will be out sooner and not in the middle of Dece December, okay? So, uh, I'm going to just get this galvanized out and I'm going to stack it somewhere so, so that if, if it is okay, I, it is just a case of me lifting it and putting it in and getting that done. Because it'll be a very quick... Uh, it will be very quick. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Stay frosty. In the comments, let me know.